Hey everyone, it's uh, Marty from Olive in Nut. Another week, another episode of the platform. Uh, hanging out with these great guys. We're one down today. Cal, where are you? You should be here we're right lost, now. We're lost without you, Cal. You're looking through someone's window, aren't you? <laughs> anyway, I'm here with uh, Jonesy. Hello. There we go. Yay! Yay. From Club Rehab. Yep. Usual Linz. G'day, guys. And this is uh, this is actually what our studio looks like at the moment. This is my mess. Very this, scientific. All the results, all the various results from the um, yeah. the World Juniors, which is still going, and yep. we've actually got it going in the background on the TV what? up there. Right now. The live live feed. Feed. This is the live feed, yeah. so zoom in there. Yeah, we've got that. our heating system as well. Yes. Oh yes, yes, yes. It's yeah. it's very harsh winter here. I'm yeah. still in shorts, but anyway. <laughs> Yeah, so we have our little heater going, and this is our, our high tech setup. And and um, so Mart's got a couple of questions for you. <laughs> Here we go. I've, <laughs> I've lost the camera. I've got I've got control. No. Um, got control of the camera. Um, so you've been vlogging for quite a bit now. Oh, uh, I wouldn't say quite a bit, but yeah, it's nearly a month. Yeah, it's been going on. Nearly a month. It's been going good. Mm -hmm. What would you say is your favourite thing that's happening with Ollie Lifting Nut at the moment? Um. Probably just the, the YouTube channel, the, the gross with the... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's definitely... Uh, the way that uh, the, the, the channel's growing and the way the videos are developing. Yeah. Yeah, the way that each, each one I'm trying to add something new to it and yeah. add a little bit more to it and make it more professional and more interesting. So, so why are you doing it? I just love weightlifting. I mean, I've been doing it from such a young age. I just, I just can't get enough of the thing. I think everyone should be doing it. But yep. Yeah, I this, this, absolutely love the sport. The shares have been awesome. We've been um, getting heaps of coverage of worlds and bloody everything mm -hmm. that's going on around the planet in weightlifting. Yeah. So if you're not on it yet, get on it now. <laughs> <laughs> that's right, Ollie Lifting Nut. That's it. <laughs> yeah. All right, mate, I'll let you go. All right. What a crazy bunch of people. The platform. Don't forget to check us out on Spreaker. We do a new episode every week. Links will be posted below, so check it out. Okay, slightly new format for the video here. The rest of the video is just going to be a bit of a training montage with me doing a voiceover. So, yeah, let us know what you think. Clean and jerk, 100 kilos. I was really, really happy with this lift. Felt so comfortable. The bar just drove straight up. Felt so in alignment. Yeah, that was that was good really really happy with that lift okay so this is actually from wednesday training wednesday morning i believe yep wednesday morning my pb for a front squat is 148 got a new 3rm pb excuse me of 140 kilos coming up shortly so leg strength is definitely on the up and up if you still got over this groin abductor issue so yeah feeling really good Okay, been a pretty good week too. Thursday I recorded a new episode for Ollie, Ollie with Nut TV on tips and how to and what's in the what, this training bag this time. So you have a look through what I carry in my training bag and also show you what um, my daughter and my son-in-law carry in theirs as well because they, they do a little bit of training. So just as a comparison, a little bit of a difference there. Okay, so that was 135. Here we go, drum roll, this is 140, this is the PV, 3RM PV. So I somehow think that 148 pretty soon is gonna be a thing of the past. So the bar was just feeling so comfortable across the chest, it was feeling great. The legs were feeling fantastic and they just wanted more and more. There we go, and number th three, yep, there we go pretty pooped after that one but yep really really happy moving on to a Friday lunchtime training session okay if you look closely you may actually notice the snatch I'm not really happy with it not a hundred percent if you watch my feet as the bar comes up past my knees the toes move out as I enter like into the second pull I feel like I'm losing a little bit of power there I, I, I could be you know getting a bit more reach with it sort of wasted energy and that is something that um, I'm working on with the coach that's 78 kilos so you notice I sat there for a few moments I'll do that again shortly with that when I do 80 kilos I do like to sit in that bottom position it's like a snatch recovery I guess same as a jerk recovery when you do the jerk 
you should probably hold the bar above hold the bar there for a couple of seconds before you bring your feet together just to get to used to sort of stabilizing holding it there hey coach lens okay so if you watch the 80 kilos now you'll see the feet move out yeah and the toes do that little funny little thing i hold the bar for a few seconds and yeah it just i just i'm really comfortable in that bottom position and i always have been so yeah, let me know if you do do a similar sort of thing as well. You know, what do you do during training? Now onto power cleans. Bar was traveling really well again. Yeah, just 90 kilos didn't actually feel that light in the past. Do feel like I'm getting stronger. Need to work a bit more on the back, obviously a little bit on the technique with the snatch. But you know, pretty happy with the way things travel at the moment. And this is 95 for a single. So you're just sort of hitting a few few power cleans. Before we move on to the back squats, one of my favorite exercises. This is 150 at the moment. So yeah, like no belt. When I, I do find that I can brace myself really well, set myself up nicely. When I don't set myself properly, the bar feels really, really heavy. But when I when I get under in that rack position there and sort of yeah, brace that midline, the bar sits really, really well. I like it feel the bar does feel lighter. Like I did a rep earlier on 160 and it felt it felt really, really heavy. I just didn't set myself, I rushed it. So this is this is 170 at the moment. So yeah, once I set myself, it's great. Okay. Moving on to the last set now. So I'd just like to take this chance to say thank you for watching the video. If you've liked it, you know, give it a thumbs up. Feel free to leave any comments. Like I said, this is just a new thing I'm trying out at the moment. Just to, you know, see what you think. Okay, uh, don't forget to check us out on Instagram. I'm on Facebook. And if you like the channel, click subscribe uh, for plenty more great weightlifting videos as we watch this last set on 170. I'd like to say thank you for watching and this is Marty from Ollie Lifting Nuts.